Hey yo guys, the name is Wolfman again, welcome to the Wolves Inn. Today, we are starting the new segment, Cheats Enabled. And today, we are going to be playing Xeno Saga. I have this set up, but I just wanted to show you just what we are going to turn on. We're going to put on Max Money. We will have Hella, Experience Gained Off Battle, TP, EP, and SP. And we don't need money. We don't really need anything else. And uh, do not enable 60 FPS mode because it screws up the movies. And don't think we need other stuff, but you can if you want. I do usually have circle to save anywhere turned on. I don't know if it causes any issues with the game, so I'll leave that off. We can also use save saves or it might crash out on me anyways. Um, other things you can put on is max HP EP strength. This stuff does not reflect in-game, but it does take effect on people. Uh, we will leave that as is. I don't think we're ever going to die. And uh, we, we can always put more stuff on. We do not... Uh, we don't need to do everything. Uh, and you can't do everything. If you do, then you probably won't say you've got to host on. But that's what we'll have at the moment. And let's start the game. So, once you load up the code breaker, it's going to say to press start when you put in the disk. And I am changing the disk right now, as you can see with my mouse. <laughs> okay, now that that's done, boom, let's start the game. That's practically all the intro you get. <laughs> Alright, new game! We're gonna watch everything. I'm gonna get off. The ground there is hard, so be careful when you dig. Yes, sir. Doctor! Doctor Masuda! What is it? Did you find something? Yeah. We followed the corridor from the lakeside. It matches the location described in the that research must be paper. It. Good. Show us where it is. It's different from the others. I knew it! It's over there. Hmm. This must be...
Commencing startup experiment. Open up an interconnection. Roger. Opening interconnection. Connecting with dummy protocol. A-line protocol zone secured. Opening cage partition. 60 seconds to release. Beginning countdown. 57, 56, 55, 54, 53, 52, 51. appearing in the temporal lobe. What's the problem? It's on the left side of the temporal lobe. I'm showing slight stimulation of the synapses in section 818. It's within permissible bounds, though. Do you want to abort? No. Let's keep going. Just stick to the menu. I'll try for a direct approach. Back me up. Roger. Launching Nataraja connection system. Password accepted. Commencing Nataraja boot up sequence. problem with the visual field connection. Hmm. Ah, I see a small break in the MT field, route K12. It looks like the bi-directional link in the V4 field is lagged too. Hold on a minute. I'll fix it now. How is it now, Chief? Okay. Looks good. Let's keep going. Roger. Proceeding with Cosmos host separation. Morning, Cosmos. How do you feel? Good morning, Xi'an. All systems are normal. Well, how about introducing yourself? I am an anti-gnosis humanoid fighting system, serial number 00000000001. Development name, KPX. Abbreviated name, Cosmos. As I am currently configured for simulated battle, my output is limited to 22% of its normal capacity. My estimated weapon specifications are... All right, that's good enough. Thanks. You are welcome. 
All I have for you today are the usual startup tests. Sorry to wake you up just for that. You'll have to go back to sleep once everything's checked out. I see. Do you feel sad or anything? A predetermined set of emotions has been hard-coded into my emotion module to better facilitate interactions with humans. In order to better facilitate a relationship with you, Chief Engineer Shion Uzuki of the Cosmos Project, Vector Industries' first R&D division, I will emit an expression such as sadness only when that response is deemed necessary. However, the emotion module of my program has determined that this is not necessary at this time. <laughs> I guess you're right. I, of all people, should know that. Your understanding is appreciated. But you know, Cosmos, I've got mixed feelings about all this. Of course, I'm happy that you're awake, but the fact that you'll go back to sleep makes me a bit sad. On the other hand, the next time you wake up, it may be a time of much bloodshed. So, deep down inside, I hope that day never comes. Understand? The algorithms I have been programmed with do not support the comprehension of illogical human thought. Well, I hope you'll be able to... understand someday. I will do my best. All right, Cosmos, shall we get started? Alan, let's pick up from process 277, where we last left off. Roger. Placing target drones in the Encephalon. The drones are set to random movement and enemy ambush. How about a test run before the mission, Chief? Hmm. Sure, let's do that. Did you get that, Cosmos? Affirmative. Oh, crashed. Okay, people, I'm back. Now, my laptop absolutely loves to crash when I do stuff on, on the laptop. But uh, we will be using safe states because it will crash on me all the time if you have a PC problem. Ritual tutorial. During quests, you'll trigger battle. When you come in contact with an enemy, here you'll need to talk to Cosmos, select from the menu, then approach the soldier to start the battle. Right, so, if we want to learn stuff, we'll do a quick run through. Normal tags. The battle program has been set. Entering battle mode, please approach the target. The battle program has been set. Entering battle mode. What? Is it? What do you want me to use? X. Nope. Uh -oh. Okay. Switching to real combat. <laughs> Our program has been set. You want to move on to real combat? Alright then, I'll transport you to your original location after the battle is over. Are you ready? Yes. I shrunk my camera, so hopefully when it moves in 4 to 3 screen, it'll be in the back order. I put the cheese back on. Oh, I'll use a safe state after this battle. It's gonna be funny. Do you really think this is a good idea? Okay. Actual sure battle. From now on, the enemies will attack. Keep your eye on the attack order to avoid taking unnecessary damage. Unit, defeat the enemy on the right first, as it can attack everyone at once. Because the enemy in the middle has high HP, it is a good idea to defeat it using tech attacks. The enemies are separated into three types. Some attacks are effective against certain types, so study the descriptions of each attack. Icon appears in the GTW. So, bio type. 
necktie and Genosis tie. Okay, I see it in the bottom right. They want me to take this guy out first. He is No, it's not. We're also gonna punch this guy. My friend asked me to play this fight five years ago, and I was very reluctant to play it. The reason for that is because this game is actually a movie. It is a movie. It's like 10% game and 90% movie. It's a bit of an exaggeration, but uh. Oh, also, uh, the next spring. Let's see. Oh, look at my money. Oh, suddenly, um, got a lot of money. Hmm, there's one battle. I sure got a good lot of experience. <laughs> see this run. See it run. I know it gets the 10. It's just fun to see it go up. Going. Okay, let's uh, maybe. It's it's close to finishing. I'll let it go for the first time. We'll we'll blitz this afterwards. You will definitely not see this during a normal play, and I don't care what you people say about playing games legitly. Somewhere in the story, you get you're very underpowered and you need to grind. You gotta grind. It's not fun grinding. Okay, it's stopped. TP's going. Okay, I'm gonna stop that piece. No items. I'm gonna save states. All processes to 300 cleared. Chief, the data transfer is going smoothly. The A-Line protocol is looking good. It sure is. The response levels are really good. If we can maintain these levels, we'll have some great results soon. Yeah. Chief? Hey, Alan. Let's skip all 300 level processes and start from 400. Huh? 400? Chief, but that's... I feel pretty confident this time. But, Chief... Remember what happened last time? Had we waited ten more seconds to intervene, we wouldn't have been able to get you back at all. Can't we at least test it out in objective mode? You know we can't get precise data that way. I'll be fine. If something happens, I'll get myself out. Besides, you want to test it out as well, don't you? We spent all night building the native A-Line protocol. Well, yeah, but... That settles it. Let's get started. All right, then. But if anything happens, I'm going to shut it down from here. So don't press your luck. All right, all right. And don't deviate from the program. Okay, Mom. Jeez, this is so typical of her. Will she ever stop to think about the hell I go through for her? You know, sir, the way you worry about Chief Uzuki all the time. I'm surprised you haven't keeled over already. Uh, hey, that's enough. Is the 400 level program ready to go? We're ready to go anytime. Then start up the program. I want detailed reports from every monitoring station. Any abnormalities, and I'm shutting down immediately. Okay. One second. One second. I just need to press F1. Sorry, I just gotta remember. 
Alright, so, Cosmos, I'll explain a bit about this place. This place is an imaginary space constructed within the network. It's modeled off of some ruin from early 2000 AD. Your mission is to fight the main target within the dilapidated building. Dilapidated building. The target is marked with a red vector box. There are boxes in here that can be detonated. Some are effective if you set them off near the enemy. Use them to your advantage. Now then, let's start the mission. Uh, before we start the mission. Something we're gonna do. Alright, let's start the mission. Okay. Alright. So, we wanna go to skills. Oh, we don't wanna. We wanna extract skills. Unset skills. Uh, what is it I want? Good characters? Use TP. There we go. Alright. So, we already are uh, picking it, but. I just ma I gotta smash this. It might take a small bit of time. Yeah, maybe not that much. My friend likes Cosmos. I like Xion. My friend says I like Xion because she's got glasses on. And then I was thinking about it, and uh, all right, I do like quite a bit of glasses. Maybe I get the best of both worlds. She takes off her glasses; she's fine as well. I don't know when this is going to crash out again on me. There's a good chance it will. I don't know. It's a conflict between OBS and the game. I could stream this to my surface, but I have to do everything offline and then you'll get offline play instead of me being on Twitch at the same time. What is EP? Oh. Oh, you got. Oh. You can't do anything. You can't use anything. Alright. Click on this. Hit one. I hope this works. <laughs> if not, then I'm gonna do some stuff again. Right, so we're gonna play this. We'll try and play this honestly, maybe. I, I don't think I ever went up this ladder whenever I play this game. Can we drop it on him? Uh, oh, I see. Oh, also, there are two modes. More or more objects that can be selected from the L1 R1 to shoot and shoot. Oh, the shoot. Uh oh hello. Are you on fire? Your orders, Xi'an. We will use they are uncle. She's just suddenly taking uh, 5,000. She practically a Hodokono Kemba's guy. Uh, look at uh, poor Cosmos. <laughs> oh, it burns. Or oh, zero. <laughs> Ooh. Enabled is for us to play RPGs and we just want to blow through them. It's practically just watching story. We just want story. Can I change the camera by any chance? Do I use circle or do I use a circle? And do we can't drop down? Can she slide? She can't slide. We'll get more e EP. Should we get more EP? I'm gonna get into this thing. Oh, we got plenty. But we can only spend so much. And do we equip? Nothing. I like Xion and her 
other outfit. Swimsuit. Skittles. What's it Skittles? Oh. Lightning Blast. It's like we're gonna get to do. Oh, fucking let's go. Oh. Gotta do it for anything? Oh, I'm, I'm burning up my TP. Ah, uh, blade. Ah, uh, cannon. Increase, increase, increase. Oops. Let's put some speed is finished for that. We gotta get the getting gun. Okay, that's nice and set. I don't think there's anything else. Yeah, people will probably not like me for playing this illegitly, but we don't have enough time to play these games. Go, 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 go. Do you really think this is a good idea? Right. Let's, let's play with some one muscle and we'll end the day. Oh, smack you. Oh! Online door. And now we've got like six EP points to play with. Four firecrackers, cherry bomb, and scullery. Sixty, yay! No more of the lost. Very cute. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 oh! What can I do? Get out of my way, or else. Oh, there's something to do there. points. It looks like we can't actually hold on to so many points at one time. Oh. So there's one thing I want to check out. Oh, I can't change it. Skills. No skills. Threat. All thing. Tick skills. DP. Okay. Uh. We'll play about good hour of this. I think about, about 45, about 20 something now. I think I have to equip these as well. Oh, okay. Okay. 
lightning. One thermal blast here. And two lightning rays. That's fine. A switch or use DP. DP is never used up. Okay, that's it. Except for you. What can we set? Our blade and Arkan are already there. I don't even think we. It's good. And now, how did I get? How did we get that box? Is that box gettable? I have no idea. It's been too long. Oh, oh, I see. I'm gonna go around the top. Before I reached the point of the save point, actually, I'm not. I'm gonna use a Do you really safe stick. Yeah. Uh, store! Store cannon! Actually hit from the back. I can't remember it all. I like play through this game once and then never again. Freeze! Ah, you're a turtle. Do you really think this is they a still good hit idea? Me. through there just as long yet. We want to go through this way. And this is where the box is on the outside. What's in here? Popping pills. Obtain revive. And this is where I got my laptop to crash. So I'm going to use 
Save state it. Or, or it might fuck up. I, I, I press buttons, that's what happened. Possible to pilot an AGWS by selecting AGWS in the sub menu. First, select AGWS from the menu. Next, use the right button, slash ref, directional button to select this position. Press the circle to call it. The turn is over after it is called. Hey guys, I am back. I had a bit of a look and I do know that Xenosaga has issues with PC SX2. I have come across one thing that actually did kind of fix it. So I'm going to show you guys right now what my settings are. So I went to video, I went to VUGS, I go to plugins. In the plugins, I have set it, I took it off the OpenGL one and I put it to Direct3D a little bit hardware. I changed it from default to NVIDIA GeForce. I left this as automatic, I left this as PS2, I ticked the 8-bit texture box for whatever reason, and I put this on full 3D, a full slow, and then I went, I enabled the hex, HW hex, and I put auto flash, fast texture invalidation, Disable depth emulation, disable depth features, and preload frame data. Hopefully this shit will actually load it better. I'm hoping. But I did try it out, it was able to get past the parts. And so, with that now said, I will start this up, and we will try and... There we go. Okay, it looks small at the moment, but... There we go. That's what we're looking for. Okay, so F3. Hopefully, I've got the widescreen hack going. Now it is working properly, and you'll now see that we can now pass it. This is shit. We don't need to watch this again. I'll play for a while. Our battle so. systems are go. <laughs> there is a bit of a edgy on the screen. Spot help you. Transmit eight! Well, it's supposed to stuff up right here, which it doesn't. Because of some stuff I need. I don't have issues on the wall. The enemies have been exterminated. <laughs> yeah, we can play it! The only thing that will crash out to me now is actually my laptop. Yeah. Should I put cheats back on? I think we should. Status check. I don't see anything unusual. All systems are stable. It's looking good. 
This ought to make up for last month. I sure hope so. Cosmos has reached the checkpoint. Entering process 431. Replacing targets with Type G drones. Commencing display. Chief, I've changed the settings on the target drones. The next target is keyed to sound like it will only respond if you make a loud noise. You can move quietly if you hold down the R2 while moving. Also, the thing behind you is a save point. If you press the circle button there, you can save your progress. Make good use of it. It's R2. No R2. Okay, so we hit circle here. Memory card. Zero save. It is now saved. Okay. Alright. Now, before we go on with this, I think we will put our cheats back on. It shouldn't be necessary, but we want some TP. Let me change the disc over. To my code breaker, the swap disk, and let's see, shut down and smart boot this again. Just start off the cheats. Oh, and I forgot to put myself on the main screen. <laughs> Alright, it's good to know that we can freaking play this game. I'm going to see what we can take off or put on. Press right. We do not need max money no more. Don't need huge money no more. Still got to save every anywhere. Uh, should we use L1 and select to escape it? We'll try this out. So this is the reason why I'm not smacking people with my ether. Ether. Rah, rah, rah. Mm, that should be fine. Okay. I am so happy that I worked that out tonight. I am so, so happy. Let us go back to the Xenos. And the good thing is, is that we can still press... No, I cannot press F3. Press F3, then we can't continue. I don't know why the picture has been so Okay! Uh, which way? Wait? This way. Wait? Okay, okay, it's been an exciting night of the screw ups. Hopefully, the screw ups will be finished. Eighth pack. Oh, actually, there's one thing that I want to check. Our oh, health is back as well. That's good. Okay. Okay. We have. Don't do anything in this section. Nothing of skills. Take a Blast. I wonder how high we can raise this. I should actually put TP on max. I think there's an option. But this is fine. And you can have your hard up late. I wonder what shit it's got to do with the graphics card, it seems. Graphics card settings that kind of hook it up. Ah! Target locked on. Okay. Commencing combat mode. Oh, it hurts. Oh, keep shooting, Shion. Bust you guys in the nuts. It's two. Thank <laughs> you. 
Just have like max attack and max uh, e, uh, EA. Okay, let's go on. I was not reading that, I got a new attack. Gee, items aren't the only things that are inside contains. Thank you. Thank you. Something is here. Oh, there's a yellow. Oh, the doors. Nope, they're people. Discover segment address ten, number ten. What do I do with these? It's marked as segment address number ten. Yes, I know. I need to blow up. In the bush. Do I walk back? Do I gotta walk back. Hmm. Hmm. Can't get out. I can't. Oh, I see. Mission key obtained. Now I can unlock the door. Which door? This door? Look, has been removed. I'm not afraid of you, punk. You wanna go on the door? Couldn't zap it in time. Get out of my way, or else. Airborne enemies. Against airborne enemies, use triangle direct line attacks. You cannot use square close range attacks. Fire! Enter. Fire! Oops. Enter. Nice. I'm gonna obliterate them. Yay. So happy. This is the door. Let's go. Target locked on. Commencing combat move. And... This is a no-go. Insert mission key. Oh, it doesn't look like a boss battle. Here we go. Going on. A brand new network is being created within the Cosmos mainframe. We've never had a reaction like this before. This is incredible. I've never seen a net grow so fast. Look at it, sir. Portions of the Encephalon map are evolving. Engage right now. 
You're tapped into Cosmos Perception. It's too unstable. Don't worry. We can pull it off. What do you mean, don't worry, Chief? Knuckle. Stun and shocker. So good. Shift target to real mode. We'll test the Hilbert effect. What? Chief, you're supposed to follow the program. Cosmos, activate Hilbert. Roger. Activating Hilbert effect. I knew this would happen. Status. This is bad. Something's wrong in the encephalon. The whole thing could collapse at any moment. What? What about the Chief? You're in danger! Get out of there now! Hold on! Just a little longer! Chief! Nerve impulse is in the limbic system! We've got Kinley! That's enough! Shut it down! Pull her out of there now! Roger! Entering shutdown command! It's been rejected! The Chief's overriding us! We can't control it from here! What? Ten seconds to encephalon collapse! Sir! Damn it! Chief? <sighs> Are you all right? Uh, yeah, thanks. Did I push my luck a little too far this time? <sighs> Alan? You can't keep doing this, Chief. I thought I was going to have a heart attack. Sorry about that. But I bet the data's really good. Besides... Huh? Was there something else? Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. Well, we better get started on that data. Today's our deadline. So I'm sure they'll be asking for it soon. Attention, please. We are scheduled to gate out in approximately three minutes. All hands, please return to your designated areas immediately. Once again, attention please. We are scheduled to gate out.
All ships, gate out complete. Shifting main engine to stealth mode. Maintaining current speed until sector with control. Exit from current space set at absolute time, 1300 on the 22nd. Seven hours, 16 minutes, and 30 seconds to withdraw. Next, UMN column in seven hours, 36 minutes. All gate jumps from other sectors will remain offline until then. So, we're almost home. Yes, sir. Our final gate jump is at the next column. We're almost there. We made it this far, we'll be fine. The odds of contact between columns is statistically low. Besides, this asteroid field we're in is perfect for hiding the fleet from them. Huh. So, Pollyanna thinks those asteroids are going to protect us. I... I'm sorry, sir. A bit testy today, aren't we, Commander? Huh? Is something wrong? No. Of course not. Ever since we picked up that object ten days ago, everyone's been a bit jumpy. And we still have a ways to go before we hit comm space. I can empathize with the Commander. Hmm. Uh, Captain? Can you... Uh, debrief us on the current situation? Our original orders from the Galaxy Federation were to investigate the vanished planet and assist the researchers. But ever since we picked up that object, it feels like everything's changed. What exactly is that thing anyway? Who knows? I haven't heard a thing from the research team. But, as I mentioned before, Apparently, they're after the object, too. That's unofficial info, of course. What about the rumor regarding the casualties during the retrieval process? Even if it were true, that's none of our business. The research team has their own orders to deal with. The only explicit instructions we've received state that should any salvageable objects exist in the area, their retrieval takes top priority. Top priority? What does that mean? What it means is, over our very lives. Now, now, no need to scare them. Those orders merely reflect the importance of this operation to the Galaxy Federation government, that's all. Just stay sharp and be careful. That makes sense, sir. The entire fleet was renovated for this mission. Besides, if there's an emergency, we've got the trump card to fall back on. Ah, uh, yes, uh, speaking of which, what's the latest on that situation? They're scheduled to turn in the A7 reports today. A7, eh? Only one step away from fully operational. It's about time, I suppose. Lieutenant, please ask Chief Uzuki to come to the bridge once her data's ready. Ask her to bring all the previous data as well. Yes, sir. What trump card? Was he referring to that battle android? That's right. You didn't know? Wow, so it's true. Hey, I heard that project's really behind schedule. You can't blame them. There were casualties during their last boot-up test two years ago. They're being more careful this time. It's hard to believe they're making an android in this day and age. The only place I've ever seen them is in old space novels. Well, trump card or not, it's still an experiment. And it ain't like one android's gonna make that much of a difference. The whole project's just a chance for those Vector guys to show off. Someone's outdated hobby, that's all. I heard that even their commercial models differ greatly between those that have seen action and those that haven't. They say ignorance is bliss. Looks like they were right. Commander? I'm just envious, that's all. Sure. I'll be there in 30 minutes. A 
They certainly didn't waste any time. See? I'm usually right about these things. Chief Uzuki, here's the data you requested. Will that be all? Thanks. This should be good enough. I'll take care of the rest. Um, Chief, do you have a second? Yes. The military is expecting actual field data for Cosmos. Is it right for us to keep giving them simulated data like this? Well, I must admit, you got me there. But honestly, if it were up to me, I'd keep her here, safe in her dream world forever. But why are you so afraid to put her to real work when you push her so hard in the simulations? I can't wait to see Cosmos up and completely functional. Couldn't you at least try taking her up to Phase 3? That should be no problem for her by now. Phase 3 in a simulated battle config? Come on. We're not about to wake our little princess for that. Here's a summary of Cosmos' main equipment from the 2nd Division. This should help you with the guys upstairs. Thanks. I'm sure it will. Okay, we are back. By the way, Chief, what did you think of the MWS and the AGWS? Oh shit, it kept crashing on me. It's just a dummy data created inside the Encephalon, but it was pretty exciting stuff, wasn't it? If none of that had problems during this test, all that remains are the finality tests using actual models. It worked pretty well. The MWS in particular felt right to me. I sent something contrived in that though. Well, I hear, I hear Miyuki is closely involved with the MWS. I'm sure she's up to something again. Oh, by the way, could you send the connection gear data to headquarters for me? You know, the vaporizer plugin that we use to destroy obstacles? I wonder if they're also going to manufacture it based on our test data. I swear, they pile everything they can on us under the pretense of testing cosmos. Well, it's inevitable, considering they have a lot of other concerns, like the budget. Okay, this is it. Put my save point. You know what I can do? I can, I can save in here, I think. Yeah, I can save. No, I cannot save in here. How do I save? This one? Start? Circle? No? Hmm, interesting. I'll save you. Jeep, I've been mean to ask you, but why are you so devoted to Cosmos? Easily sensitive system. I think we should be focusing our research on Cosmos, outlying systems in order to develop a weaponry. Hmm, Jeep. There was a strange interference earlier. Did anything unusual happen during the dive? There's no record of it in our log. I don't know what to make of it. Okay, I understand you have your reason, but a machine is only as meaningful as the functional goals it fulfills. Perhaps Cosmos would be happiest if she were able to demonstrate her full cap capabilities. I'm sure there's supposed to be a machine here. Save machine. Enlightening those jarheads for you, tell them that development research is a living, breathing thing. Gee, shall we try the startup experiment again? If there's any items you didn't get last time, I should suggest you go get them now. I'm sure they'll be useful in the real world too. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oops, I pressed back. Oh, fuck, what happened?
Oh, oh well. Do not. I'm not from Afghanistan. <laughs> Whoa, this is so winter. Okay. I think I've been kicked out. I will get us back. And then we will resume doing this. I knew I should have used the, the save state. Hmm. I should have used the save state. Boop, boop. Okay, guys, thank you for watching, and I will get this up and running, and over, I'm over and out. I'm tired. Trouble, troubleshooting. Bye-bye.